Uh, hello. Posted a bug with this version of Wings before regarding. Well, first I'll show you the Wings. So you know it is. 1.3.1. I think it might have been in the previous version, but yeah. Not so long in names. So. Because when a version gets long, I find that kind of funny, but this version's nice and short and sweet. But anyhow. What I found before I thought it was just a general texturing bug, but now I think it's a very specific kind of texturing bug. And it seems to be particular to the AMD Radeon line of graphics cards. The NVIDIA users have not complained about this, but the ATI AMD people have. And I, I used to be NVIDIA, but because I updated my computer, it came with the chipset and, well, it's not a story. It seemed to work decent enough for most things, so I figured I'd stick with it for now. Try not to spend the money if I don't have to. So, here we go. Essentially, what happened is here, I'll just show you. Any of the textures, let's see the size here. The materials, they changed somewhere along the way. One of the attributes got changed, and vertex colors became like a default part of wings now. And I never really used the vertex colors for doing most of my model work. I just textured them and or I just set them a plain slate color and uh, use procedurals, but nowadays support texture colors. I guess it's for game work or something, but so all my old models came in with the vertex colors set to ignore. And it's fixed now. Oh no it's not see here on the tail? certain parts of my model when the vertex colors were set to ignore they would just show up as black like this tail is here or here I'll go I guess there would be another one now I'll show you calling I'll set that to ignore yeah see how this one is all stretched out funny they either show up stretched out funny like that or blacked out like that. When you're trying to see your textures and do things to make sure they're correctly mapped, like this section here you can still see is correct looking, or that way. But when you're trying to see if you got stretching or seams or anything funny, and you render like that, obviously it's useless. But it turns out, with the AMD cards, you gotta go through every material in Wings 3. And you want to set your vertex colors from ignore to multiply. Boom, now it is correct. The same words as hides. Yep, there it is. Add material, set it to multiply. Boom, see how the tail is there? Now you can see all your UV mapped textures as they should render. So if you've been pulling out your hair like using Queen City. <laughs> It's not often, but sometimes it happens. Little things happen. You know, it's just the nature of things, but it turns out it's an unforeseen consequence of changing how they did things. And, but a fix exists, so until they fix how ignore vertex colors is handled, you just gotta go through and set everything to multiply. And if you see like little spots of color after you do that, the simple fix is to just click model in object mode, click vertex, and then go vertex color, and just make sure to drag the V all the way over to white and all those goofy little colors go away. Or you can set them, but I don't really use vertex colors, so this is the fast fix and it has worked. But for now, that's the way to do it. Alright, signing off.